before we even start off this dorm haul video like let me show you guys like what the heck is going on in my room guys like this is like a whole other level of like shopping hey guys welcome to or back to my channel my name is mary cantalejo and if you are new here hello i haven't been back in a quick minute right after graduation life just went crazy um today i'm going to be showing you guys my dorm haul so, yeah let's get started i feel like i'm just gonna go on to like different things like whatever i grab first they're kind of all over there in the corner so i have to go like back and forth so that like, the space looks clear and i also don't repeat the same things if that makes sense these are my pillows i got them from home goods they are the oh my god it says 29 it says the price on here shoot 29.99 so 30 dollars and these are a memory foam cluster pillow in a two-pack standard and i just got two standard pillows i kind of like cooling pillows so i kind of like splurged on good pillows but not really splurged because full price of like gel pillows are pretty expensive at that to be honest so i have this big bag so warning you it's gonna get like little crunchy audio so i got this packing bag from ikea it's like a storage cube have this pillow it was actually $12 from Hobby Lobby they had a sale and it's really cute it has a cute little print to it and it has like these um, tassels on the side and it's really cute and matches my next pillow this is my pillow it is from Amazon it didn't come with the pillow inside so I have to buy a separate um, sleeve but this is my pillow and I think it's just so cute and it literally matches my pillow I don't know it's just so cute <laughs> it's just so cute i love it next thing i got for my bed is a pillow encasement protector i also got the wrong size for my pillow protector which is fine it's not a big deal to me it was cheaper than the standard one but i should have gotten the standard one i don't know but i got a king size pillow protector for bugs and spill proof and stuff and whatever it's king but it's fine then i got this really 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 soft blanket it is from marshall's sorry i think i haven't like said where that pillow protector was from that pillow protector was from amazon and this is the softest like blanket ever it's so cute it is from marshall's and it doesn't really match my pillow but i saw how soft it was or i felt how soft it was and i had to cop really cute on top of that i'm gonna have this white fluffy blanket not sure if i'm gonna continue using it just because this literally gets dirty so easily but it's just so cute it's like a white fluffy blanket i've had this white fluffy blanket for a while and i just felt like using it in my dorm too so really cute really soft matches my blanket but doesn't really match my pillows i don't know it's cute next thing i got is this sheet sheet set sheet set it's a twin extra long and it's from charter club from the me i think it's a charter club collection but it's from macy's my sheets are kind of expensive just because i have really sensitive skin and just regular bedding on me irritates my skin and just starts doing all stuff on my face as you can see right now my face is like jacked up right from my eczema and it's because i've been sleeping at other people's houses and just some sheets just don't work on me which sounds super privileged um but it just doesn't work and it irritates my skin and i start scratching and itching and i don't really realize it but you know life stories uh but this is from charter club it is a 400 thread count and i'm not going to take this out but it's really soft like i'm going to open it right now like it is so soft and i'm so excited and the quality of this is really great too i really wanted to get quality bedding just because for my dorm for my school we don't have like college apartments so you know you kind of just stay in the dorm for a while so because I'm staying there for the dorm for a while, I had to get like nice sheets for myself since I'm going to use it every year. I don't want to keep buying, you know, buying and buying new ones. And they're white, so probably not the best option, but it was really nice. And we're back to the protectors again. I got a mattress protector and this is, um, it's by Premium. Is that what it's called? I think that's what it is. It's 
this mattress protector. It's from Amazon and it's pretty great. Actually, I don't even know. <laughs> um, I heard it's pretty great. I'm pretty sure this is Twin XL. Twin XL. And this just helps with um, bug bites or bug bites. Um, bugs and it's waterproof so you don't really stay in your mattress topper which i will show my mattress topper in a bit but this. and the next thing i got is a mattress protector and or um, no not mattress protector that was a mattress protector this is a mattress um a gel mattress pad like a pad for my bed so you put your the mattress is here right and the mattress is like really rough and really hard to sleep on so you get a gel memory foam and then you have this on top to add extra like pr not pr extra protection number one and number two it also just makes it a lot comfier and then your protector will cover the whole thing just to make sure that no bugs seep through and yeah like your mattress topper um this is from home depot and i got it for 50 percent off i'm not going to take it out and show you guys just because if you unravel this you can't put it back in the box because it's vacuum sealed <laughs> that was so okay so i needed more space to like move around like a little dilemma a little vent um i had to move everything outside again because there's just no space in my room to like walk around and actually get the stuff if that makes any sense like to get the items to show you guys it's like a whole mess so this is my bedding i got this from the macy's collection or like the charter club collection from macy's and super soft i'll show you I'm, i won't like show you guys the whole thing but it's really soft i'm so excited fun fact this is just the same bedding I have, just smaller. So now we're moving on to the fun stuff. I'm gonna be showing you guys all of like the little gritty stuff that I have, if that makes sense. So the first thing I have here are command hooks. Yeah, fun. Um, I just have this one that, you know, is a hook that you could hook on to. And then I have this one where it's just like a, sticky tab and this is gonna hold i'm gonna cut it and it's gonna hold our mirror down and then it's gonna hold a couple of my pictures down i also got blue painter's tape and i'll explain a little bit later too why i need blue painter's tape but basically um blue tape painter's tape comes off easily and it doesn't take out the paint with it so it's really nice really handy and i bought a new one because our old one like doesn't even like stick anymore this garland oh my god there's like hair on it what the heck is going on this garland i got it from hobby lobby and it was eight dollars and it's really pretty and we're gonna hang it around our mirror next thing i have is this like vine thing and this is gonna go above my bed and on my desk and then this garland is going around our mirror because this is kind of our um theme for our room like a little pink a sudden a sudden tone of pink but not too much pink you know i don't have a lot of decor because i'm too lazy to put them up <laughs> okay so now we're gonna move on to the like kitchen stuff if that makes sense so first things first i have these containers i got two of them um they're from ikea and i believe they were two dollars each the next thing I got are ice cube um, tray. I got an ice cube tray. I didn't get that many. I just got an ice cube tray for myself because we don't have an ice machine at my school. Only in the cafeteria, but my cafeteria is pretty far away from my dorm. The next thing I got is a lint roller. Um, it was only, I think, 60 cents. All from Ikea, by the way. Next thing I got is a paper holder stand. A lot of people are like, you don't need that. But like, honestly, I spill so many things in my own house that this is the one thing I honestly always needed. Like, always needed to grab paper towels or a rag or anything. And because I spill so much, rags aren't enough for me. So paper towels. Not a paper towel holder. This is not a kitchen item but i have an umbrella in here so i just feel like showing you guys i have an umbrella even though it doesn't rain here in california next thing i got are chip clips i got these from i believe marshall's next thing i got were sponges and they were like a dollar at ikea for three sponges i got myself some silverware from ikea and it was only five dollars for the set of I don't even know is there's 16 utensils in here next thing i have here is our keurig my roommate and i are gonna share this because she got the refrigerator and i just got the keurig and 
it's just a Keurig. I mean, really nothing special to it. Just a Keurig, but it's nice and the color's black. So I got two of these. I got them from, I believe, Target for $10 each. And they just kind of open like this, like they're like that. They open like this and I'm using one of them for my medicines and the other one for my bathing suits. And yeah, I believe just my bathing suits. I'm not completely sure yet what I'm gonna do with them, but I'll figure it out when I'm there. This is from Marshalls, a shit guys. I just don't want it to like fall, but they have like little drawers in them. It's like a makeup organizer, but I don't really know if I'm gonna use it for makeup. I kind of might put some of my school supplies in here. I don't have drawers in my desk at school, so they're kind of just out in the open. So I decided why not put like my pencils in here, post-its, whatever I need to get in here. And it's just super cute and I really like it. Okay, so this is my favorite, favorite part of my desk. These are acrylic organizers that I got from Ikea. They were $14. They're not all like this. So one of them is like shaped like this. And then three of them are shaped like this. And I, as you can see, I got really excited and I already opened it. So I put cotton buds in here. And then the other three, I have no idea what I'm gonna do with them but they're super cute, really cute. I don't know, I get really excited. I don't even know what to put in these. If you have any idea, DM me and let me know. Then they have the larger one and it, it's also, it was a part of a set. So it's uh, one of these and then three of these and then one a large one. And in here, I kind of keep all my school supplies. I don't really feel like showing you guys all my school supplies just because you've seen it before, you've seen it in my back to school haul. They're all the same, but basically in here I have pens, pencils, um, lead pencils, wooden pencils, post-its, flashcards, ruler, and pencil pouches all in this one bin and I kept it really concise because, concised? Concised? What is it called? Concised? I don't even know what it's called, but pretty much I just wanted to keep it small for the dorm and I feel like this is just more than enough because everything's online pretty much this year. I've always had this basket in my room and a lot of the clothes I already donated that were in this basket, so I decided why not bring it to the dorm? It's kind of broken and patched up, but she's still cute. So I'll have this and then I have the two cubes, so these are my baskets for my dorm. Okay, so now we are gonna move on into my bathroom stuff. First things first, I need to have a toothbrush cover. I mean, I'm living in the dorms. Everyone's always sick in the dorms. I'm just gotta cover like the random things, like a toothbrush. Next, this is not bathroom, and it's also really impractical, but I promise there's a reason why I got this. So in here, I have, there's three little mason jars, and my laundry like room, I think is like, three stories down and we don't have an elevator so um i don't feel like carrying my laundry detergent like the heavy laundry detergent and stuff so i'm just gonna put my fabric softener my laundry detergent and like the beads to put in here and to make my clothes smell good at the dorms um in these little containers and then i'll put it with my um, laundry backpack which i'll show you right now this is my laundry backpack um it's from amazon and pretty much like i'm basically gonna keep like the glass jars in this pouch and so when i go downstairs i don't have to lug that like gallon of um, laundry detergent all the way to my dorm room so pretty cute pretty pretty functional okay so i have two loofahs from marshall's i forgot what brand it's called i know they're sustainable um so get sustainable ones you know save the planet i have this really 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 soft um cloth uh what is it called wash towels for like there's a four set in them and they're by uggs next thing i got are shower shoes i got them from target and they were eight dollars you're nasty if you go in the shower and you don't put on shower shoes and then i have this shower caddy and i believe it is from amazon and it was i believe like five dollars on amazon and then i have two towels i have this one and then i have this one they are from macy's and i got them over quarantine so i mean they were really cheap like these are lacoste uh lacoste or lacoste pillow or pillows towels are really soft and honestly really big for like what i mean 
it, it's, it's huge it was like ten dollars for one towel and i mean it's really soft really durable and really big too okay so i got another bag from ikea it's another crunchy bag but this time it's like a tote it's like this and it fits a lot so on my desk i'm going to have a diffuser it smells honestly it's it's really good what the heck um this is for my uh, dorm why is there not a lot in there anymore i'm a little concerned but it smells like lemon it smells like watermelon what but like diffuser you need that because like dorms like stink this little caddy thing i'm gonna fix the shape of this Blah. Uh, this um, caddy thing from I believe Target and it was I think five dollars I should have gotten two of these I just got one really cute and I'm gonna put I think my chargers in here this is a mini USB cable it's really tiny it's like this big and I have this for my lamp which I'll show you guys in a bit uh, this is just to put my portable charger in my purse like I just I don't need a long ass cord you know I just need a small one because it's portable so I got portable USB cord speaking of cords I got this extension cord I have two I have using one for my broom and then this one I got from Amazon and I believe it was like $20 for this and this is kind of how it looks it has a USB port and then four other outlets this is gonna go right next to my bed and these are really cool I'm really excited about these these are here I'll show you guys but you put your cord on here right oh my god there's hair on it you put your cord on here so that when you go to your bed you don't have to go on your floor and like find the cord it's literally just here you pick it up plug it in super easy i'm lazy this is like the epitome of lazy this is going to be one for my side of my bed and then there's going to be one on my desk and then i have an extra one if anybody needs it you know what i mean if my roommate wants one i mean these are pretty handy but the problem is the adhesive in the back rips off the paint so this is when i'm going to use my painter's tape to um, attach it onto the side of my bed instead of using the sticky stuff smart Honestly, I would love to use one for my room too, like my room at home. <laughs> I have phone chargers in here, 10 foot long. You don't really need to see it. Just 10 foot long chargers. And then I have this pouch that has my Sharpies, Expo markers, stuff like that, like random supplies in here, which I needed a Sharpie so I could label all of my boxes. So I might have to do that soon leaving in four weeks four or five weeks and still haven't really packed but packed packed enough if that makes sense and then i have this like measuring thing i thought i might need it i don't know and then i have this mirror it is from i believe i think i just got this for christmas and it's really cute and i'm gonna put this on my desk it doesn't even match like this color does not match my room whatsoever but i have it and it's nice and there's not a lot of mirrors in the dorms so okay so we are heading into the last two things for my dorm finally um i have this thing this is like a shoe organizer um it is from ikea it's basically like a large locker stand <laughs> that's how i see this thing it's like a large locker stand last last thing is this bed organizer um actually i don't really know if i'm gonna get more dorm stuff but that's just like the basic essentials i need to live into the dorms like you know water food everything i'm getting it um when i get to the dorms but this is the last thing this is an under the bed organizer it's from ikea and I believe it was $11 and it just covers the whole thing. I don't know, it has like a cover for it and I'm basically gonna put all of my winter clothes in here and extra tote bags and stuff to when I go home. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, if you guys wanna know more like dorm stuff and like how I've been like shopping for college, go follow my TikTok, it's linked down below. It's also just my name, Mary Cantaleho. Go follow it and I'll see you guys later in my next video. Bye.